best days or my worst days Fuck around and get a replay Immediately, no delay Put you on niggas' jobs play Grown nigga, no pre-k Boom, boom Alright, man, we back But, um, before I get into the point of this video I kinda, I fell in love with SZA recently, right? And I was watching the video You know, this, this video right here And, uh, I can't help but notice the one part Oh my god, look, bro Oh, look, oh, so graceful, such balance. But look, bro, this jawline is kind of freaking me out. And I don't, I don't want to talk too much about it because I got I got a crush on her right now. But that that little one part right there, that that jawline kind of fucked me up. If you notice, they showed it like real quick. The cameraman was like, "Oh, oh shit, you know, let's not show that." I don't know. I don't want to get much into it. Let's get into the point of the video, right? All right, so. I posted this April 2nd, 2019, back when uh, I was trying to wake people up on Facebook, but it's really pointless to do on Facebook because niggas is there for jokes and games and shit, and they don't take shit serious. So that's a big part of the reason why I just left Facebook alone. But um, yeah, this story came about because um, I forgot exactly where I heard this, but I always heard that the media has the right to lie to you. So I looked it up, I researched it, and I found this article back in back in April. Basically, long ass story short about this article. A family felt felt like um who was it? Fox Fox News was lying on them about some shit. You know what I'm saying? So they sued. Fox News went to the court and not counter sued, but didn't shit happen to Fox News. Nothing happened to Fox News because the court ruled that the media has the right to lie. So Fox News got away with a bunch of propaganda about this family. Now, when you take shit like that into account, that's a big part of the reason why you should never, ever trust the fucking media. These niggas literally, in the books, in court, have the right to lie to you. And if you speak out against it, AKA, you know, when I made my little video about um the vaccines and you know the um the the epidemic that we're going through and I exposed the steps they were gonna take to make us take the vaccine or how they're gonna corner us into forcing us to uh, take the vaccine. When I uploaded that video, they took it down and labeled it as misinformation. Even if I was lying, how the fuck can you take my video down, but you won't take, you know, other media news, big news outlets shit down, you know, for them lying. I'm thinking as I'm talking. And I hate when I do that shit because I sound fucking retarded and my words get real choppy. But y'all know what I'm trying to say, right? I need to write down notes. That's what the fuck I'm going to start doing. So my videos will be more put together, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, whole point in this video, legally, the media has the right to lie to you. Don't trust these motherfuckers, man.